everyone. Welcome back to the channel. I'm going to read you a quote from a Stephen Pressby book that I've read recently. Fantastic book. It's called Do the Work. A child has no trouble believing the unbelievable. Nor the genius, nor the madman. It's only you and I with our big brains and our tiny hearts who doubt and overthink and hesitate. It's a human trait, isn't it? To doubt ourselves, to overthink, and to hesitate, and to mull over our ideas for hours, days, weeks, longer, and to procrastinate because of this. As I steadily approached 50, I started to question this human trait. Uh, it, I always thought it was just part and parcel of me being me. But when I read this Stephen Pressfield book, I learned about what resistance was. To quote once again from the book, we'll hit every predictable resistance point along the way. Fear, self-sabotage, procrastination, self-doubt. Now self-doubt is a big one. It's a big one for me, definitely. So many times in the past when I was making my violin videos, the self-doubt would be there. But as I read through this book, the ineffectiveness of self-doubt started surfacing. The fourth paragraph of the book's forward was written by Seth Godin, and it reads, Here's a keyboard connected to the entire world. Here's a publishing platform you can use to interact with just about anyone at any time for free. You wanted a level playing field, one where you have just as good a shot as anyone else. Here it is, do the work. The more I read of the book, the more I began to realize that my imposter syndrome was going to leave the building. And at that moment, I made it my crusade to learn as much as I could about filming myself performing the violin so that I could raise the standard of my work. There was a tutorial by Peter McKinnon that I found to be the starting point for my learning quest. And it was this particular video that gave me an awareness of how to capture footage from different angles, from different perspectives, rather than just clamping the iPhone in one position and shooting the video in one take. The illuminating advice in the tutorial was all about camera placement. Finding the most obscure, unique angle to tell your story from, that people don't usually get to see things from. Fresh perspectives, finding those weird, uncommon places to mount and clamp your camera. Don't just think dead straight. Don't just think from the side. Don't just think overhead. Get creative. I mentioned there fresh perspectives. That's how I'm approaching my violin work. Now these fresh perspectives, they're not related specifically to my violin performance. The daily consistence of practice has always been there. It has never lapsed over the course of the four decades that I've been playing the violin. The dissecting of a bar of music, practicing it at an extremely slow tempo to begin with, in order to allow the movement of the fingers over the fingerboard to become an automatic behavioural chunking action. The fresh perspectives I'm referring to focus on how I'm actually capturing the footage of performing my violin. So the first thing for me to consider with filming this footage was my equipment. Now I had an iPhone, I had a Joby Gorillapod and a clamp. But what I learned from the tutorial that I just mentioned was a piece of equipment called the Manfrotto Photo Variable Friction Arm. And this piece of equipment has been a game changer. It literally allows you to clamp your iPhone at any angle and secure it and shoot the video and film the footage. The creative possibilities are limitless. According to Creative Live, one of the most important pieces of equipment that you can have is a powerful sense of creativity and I've been stirring the creative cauldron, learning all about how 
allowed to film myself performing the violin, exploring ways of capturing the footage from quirky perspectives, perhaps from floor level, looking up at the underside of the violin, perhaps from the scroll of the violin, looking down along the fingerboard beyond the bridge. And just like I said earlier, creative possibilities are limitless. Until my next video, thanks a million for being with me today.